downtown Disney, almost at Disney Springs, doing a pumpkin pursuit. It is Halloween time. It's this little card. It's Pluto's pumpkin pursuit, and you have to, as you can see here, put a sticker of the painted pumpkin you see and where you found it. So a little bit of a spoiler alert. Well, you don't know what's underneath it, but I guess I can tell you. Under one of the at one of the Starbucks, there was this pumpkin painted on top. So, um, and I, I'm sh going to show you that. So, so all the stickers you need are on the bag. That's what all the pumpkins look like. This is where they all are. You just have to match the pumpkin to where you get it. So let's do it. There's a pumpkin. I'm not gonna tell you exactly where it is, but I bet you can figure it out. <laughs> All right, time to go to World of Disney. The thing I didn't say earlier is that whenever you finish this, you get to trade it in for like a, a cute like coffee travel mug. So let's go take a look at this. There are a few different really cute choices. So just, if it wasn't obvious, this is gonna be a lot of spoilers for this. But I just wanna show like how to do it and how fun it can be. If you're trying to kill time, like maybe you have Iggy Boogie Bash tickets, you can't get into the park quite yet, you didn't have a reservation for the park before the party, this is something really fun to do. So I am about to go in World of Disney, and it says near the exterior waterfall there is a pumpkin, and at the entrance there is a pumpkin. So I need to find both of those things. I'm definitely going to see the one by the entrance, because that's where I'm about to go. But I'm not quite sure... Like, is this the waterfall that they mean? Because oh, here's a waterfall. It's across from World of Disney. So is this what they mean? Um, I don't know. I don't think that's what they mean because I didn't see a painted pumpkin. But here is the entrance. So let's see if we can find one here. Either I'm really bad at this or it's, oh, just kidding, I see it. This is one that's not being used right now as an entrance. But you can see, whoops, but you can see as we get closer here on top of that World of Disney sign, there's one that looks like Mickey. There it is. Cute. Now we're going to peel off this one, stick it where we saw it on the entrance. Boom, two down. Here's another waterfall. I'm pretty sure this is a different one. And there is a pumpkin. <laughs> this is the waterfall outside of World of Disney. Yes, let's mark it off. This is the Moana pumpkin. We're gonna stick it at World of Disney exterior waterfall. Very cute. All right, let's go see if we can find some more. So there's 13 in all. We've done three out of 13. We have 10 to go. Wait, I almost passed one up. It says La Brea Bakery Cafe Fountain, which is this guy. So let's go see. Oh, I spot him. Okay, here's some normal fish pumpkins. And then in the tree. Oh, I got it. Oh my gosh. Yay. All right, let's mark it off. Okay, I went to peel off the sticker because I was looking for the Stitch Pumpkin and I noticed that there was a Lilo Pumpkin. So then I started looking and Stitch is in this little area here and over to the side, there's Lilo's Pumpkin. Oh, really cute. Pretty. Oh, and then... Where did I just see that? There it is. Okay. So now we have nine left to go. Whoops. Getting worried that I passed something, but I don't think I did. I think the confectionery might be next. Maybe. And then the um, Uva Cafe and Bar that's right in the middle. Yes, okay, I see the confectionery. I see Uva. And then I think right across from those are going to be Salt and Straw. And then a little farther down, we'll have Star Wars Trading Post. And across from that, Ralph Brennan's, Disney Home. Splitsville's also up in there somewhere. So the farthest one is going to be Disney Pin Traders and Monorail Station, because that's at the end. So, we are like not even halfway done, but we're very close to a bunch of them right now. So, I think it'll go pretty quickly. 
Here is Marceline's confectionery. So where is the pumpkin? They're usually up at the top if it's on a building and I don't see it there. Hmm. Where are you? Pumpkin. It's not inside, right? Like they wouldn't put it inside. Okay, am I just totally missing it? I'm gonna have to ask for this. I will check back in when I find it, I guess. So it is inside the window. There's Donald. Okay, so that was Donald at the Marceline's Confectionery. And right as I'm sitting here trying to do this, right up ahead of me is Salt and Straw. And there's little Pluto. He's cute. Let's mark him off too. And that was at, <laughs> I'm destroying this thing. That was at Salt and Straw. Okay, what's the next closest one? I think it's Uva. Let's go. Okay, this is not where I was originally looking. I was looking at the bar, but up on this tower, we have this one, which is Goofy. All right, so putting him on Uva, we have five, uh, six left. All right, and as I am turning and looking up, there's the home store, and there's the Minnie Mouse pumpkin. Cool. Ah. Well, that was, I was trying to do that while standing. That was hard. So there are a lot of people doing this right now, so it's funny to hear everyone else doing it too. Um, I think it's like a kill time before boogie bash type thing. So let's see what else we have. The next thing is Splitsville, the next closest thing. And then we're really close to Ralph Brennan's too. So, that's blacktop. There's let's, go. let's see what we can find. Oh, I already see it. Okay, it's a white pumpkin. Let's go. There he is. There's Baymax. Okay. Golly. There we go. <laughs> so, that was the Splitsville one, Baymax. Now we have four left. So, right across from where I am, that is Ralph Brennan's kitchen. Let's go see if we can find the one that's there. Okay, we are now right up on Ralph Brennan's. So let's see if we can find it. Oh, I see it, it's way down here. Oh, and it makes so much sense why they put this pumpkin here. Here we go, and that is here at Ralph Brennan's. Jazz kitchen. Okay, got my Tiana sticker. There is Ralph Brennan's. All right, Pin Traders, Monorail Station are at the end. Star Wars Trading Post, we are close. Okay, wait, I, there's Pin Traders. I totally pass up Star Wars Trading Post. Oh no, it's over here. Okay, Pin Traders is actually closer. And so you're, this is actually one of the stations you can turn this in to get your cup or at World of Disney. So they have one at each end, which is nice. So if you're starting at one end and go to the other, like you can still get your cup at the other end. So here's Pin Traders. Oh, I'm definitely gonna have to come look at some pins. There it is. All right, so let's see. I think that's a Pinocchio. This thing is getting all bent up because I kind of like have to bend it to get the sticker. All right, let's see. Disney's Pin Traders. There we go, two left. We're approaching Star Wars Outpost and, or I'm sorry, Trading Post. And I can guess which one it'll be. <laughs> but let's find it. Oh, I see it. Okay, so here's the Trading Post and right there is a BB-8 pumpkin. Let's mark it off. Okay, so we only have one left and it's gonna be pretty obvious that it's also the last sticker. It's gotta be Daisy. It's at the monorail station, but I do wanna see it. Like, I really do wanna go find this pumpkin, so let's go. Very directionally challenged. I thought that the monorail station was right after Star Wars Trading Post, but it's right before it from the direction it was coming from. And obviously, because, duh. Here's the Star Wars Trading Post. Here's the Lego store behind the monorail station. Hello. Let's go find it at this area. Because it's closed, but they still put a pumpkin here somewhere. Hmm. 
it's gotta be Daisy. Is this a lost cause? I think this is the station and it is closed. But it's gotta be somewhere. <laughs> See it. I wasn't looking high enough. There's Daisy. Cute. Alright, that's the last one. Alright, gotta mark it off. Okay. Oh. Boom. That was it. We have finished. Let's go trade it in for a mug. Yay, thank you. I just got this one. It's mini and it says Halloween magic. That was so fun. I highly recommend it. Again, if you have the time and you're like trying to kill time. That is the end of the pumpkin pursuit. I traded it in. I got my cup. I love it. It's so cute. It's so worth $10. It's fun. Scavenger hunts I just love. I always have. Um, do it. If you have time, do it. it. It was a lot of fun. Thanks for hanging out with me and hunting for pumpkins with me and I'll see you in the next one.